Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my go-to glam everyday makeup look. This is the glam that I go to when I really want to look nice and be a little extra on the daily though because it is toned down. It's really, really easy to create actually. But, um, you know, of course I had to add like some glitter and stuff just because that's me. But I'll show you guys ways in the tutorial to make it a little less glam if you are more interested in something like that. And this video is really special to me because I was actually challenged by you by Kotex to show you guys what makes me feel best. So obviously it's this glam makeup. Up look. So I was so excited to have gotten the opportunity to partner with you by Kotex and Collective Bias to show you guys this look. So when it is that time of the month and I want to feel my best, this is the makeup look that I do go to kind of as a little pick-me-up and I do use the you by Kotex Barely There liners. You guys can get these at Walmart and these keep me comfortable and confident throughout that time of the month. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get on into the tutorial. Alrighty you guys, so starting off with a completely bare face, I'm first going to prime the skin with the Maybelline Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. I absolutely love this primer. For my foundation, I'm going to go in with the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow. I have this in shade 205. I did do a full first impressions on it. I'll link it down below in case you guys are interested, but I absolutely love this foundation for every day. So I'm just blending that out with a dampened sponge. For my concealer, I'm going to go in with the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. I have this one in the shade Sand. And I'm just going to put this underneath my eyes in a triangle to conceal and brighten that area. And then just to balance out that highlight, I'm going to bring it down the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow, my chin, and my forehead. And then I'm just going to continue to blend that out with a dampened sponge. And if you guys did want to keep this a little more natural for the daily, you could just do concealer and skip foundation altogether or just use a BB cream. To set my under eyes, I'm going to go in with the Maybelline Master Fix Powder. This is the only area that I'm going to be setting just so my under eye concealer doesn't crease, but I'm going to leave the rest of my face nice and dewy. For my brows, I'm going in with the L'Oreal Brow Stylus Definer. I really, really like this, and I'm using the shade Blonde. Sometimes I do a darker brow and use the brunette shade, but on my more natural days, I like to use the blonde shade, so just filling in my brows with that. Then I'm going to use this L'Oreal La Palette Nude. I absolutely love it. And I'm just going in with this neutral blending color first and popping this into my crease area to deepen it up and emphasize that crease area. And then all over the lid, I'm going to go in with this light shimmery color just to add a little sparkle to our lids because you guys know I love me some sparkle. For highlight, I'm going to go in with this light shimmery shade and I'm just going to pop this beneath my brow bone to really emphasize that area. And I'm also going to bring it into my inner corner as well to really make that area of the eye pop for us. For my liner, I'm just going to pop on this NYC liquid liner in black. I'm not doing a wing or anything, just a very thin line on my lash line there. And then you guys know I have to be super extra. So I'm going with this Revlon Photo Ready Eye Art. This one is in the shade Topaz Twinkle. And I'm just adding the sparkle side to my inner, inner corner just to give it a little bit of a pop. But if you want this to be more natural, you can just skip that. But I had to do it. Then going in with my Salon Perfect 615s, these are my favorite lashes, just applying those. And then jumping in with this darker chocolate brown color just to line my lower lash line and smoke it out a bit. Now onto the cheeks, I'm going to contour out with this Rimmel Kate Contour Kit. This is the medium one, so I'm just contouring out my cheeks with the bronzer in that kit. For my blush, I'm going in with Twinkle Pink from e.l.f. and just applying that to my cheekbones. It's a really pretty pinky shade. And then for my highlight, I'm going in with Reserve My Cabana from Wet n Wild and applying this to the tops of my cheekbones as well as down the bridge of my nose and right above my cupid's bow just to emphasize those areas. Moving on to mascara, I'm going to go in with the L'Oreal Miss Manga Mascara and just pop this on my lower lashes and my upper lashes to blend them in with the falsies. And then for our lips, I'm just going in with the shade 600 from the L'Oreal Privy collection. I'm probably totally butchering that, but it's a really pretty frosty pink color. Very great for every day. And then just topping that with a clear gloss. So this is the completed look. I do hope that you guys did enjoy this tutorial. I will link all the products that I use down below as well as more information about the You Buy Kotex products and where you guys can find them at your local Walmart if you are interested. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. It means so much to me. I love you and I'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye!